finding equivalent ratios. This example asks us to find two equivalent ratios. Now, an equivalent ratio is one that represents the same exact ratio. It'll just be in different terms. For example, I have this ratio 4 to 12. Now, I can also write this ratio as a fraction. So if I have 4 to 12 written as a ratio, I can also write this as 4 over 12 as a fraction. So when I'm looking for equivalent ratios, I'm also looking for equivalent fractions. The first thing I could do is I could multiply both the numerator and the denominator by 2. This is going to give me a new fraction of 8 over 24, or if I were to write this as a ratio, 8 to 24. We can also go the other way. If I want to make this ratio smaller, I have 4 over 12. I could divide each of these by 2. That's going to give me a new fraction of 2 over 6, which I can write as a ratio of 2 to 6. Notice that in all of these ratios, the second number is 3 times larger than the first number. As long as that relationship stays intact, then we'll have equivalent ratios.